This song is for all my fans out there. Oh god, it kills me. What's up, guys? I'm just kidding. I'm not really crying. I was just... Okay, we're back. Uh, Legend of Zelda... What? Wait, I'm playing a Pona song. That's not the song I want to play. No, 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 no. They've got alcohol in here. That is totally... Whoop. Totally, totally inappropriate. Okay, so now that we're done here in the bar and ship, let's head to our seventh warp point, which is all the way out there on the Great Bay Coast. Because now it's time to go to the Zora Hall, baby! <sighs> He's twitching over there, what the hell? Okay, we've got more work to tend to. With, um, you know, stuff. Uh, where's my Zora mask? There it is. Now watch out, because this place is really freaky at night, because there are way, way more like-likes than necessary. Yeah, like, over here especially, there's just like a jillion and a half like-likes. It's really quite annoying. Look at this, and they're huge! Oh my god, they're giga-like-likes, man. Giga gargantuars. Okay, so... Fucking fish, you wanna eat my lightning, motherfucker? You too? Okay, so this here is the entrance to Zora Hall. You can go around back, or you can just go through the bottom here and zap the like like on your way and just teach him who's boss. And here we are. This is Zora Hall. Beep boop boop beep boop boop boop. And of course, gotta have a, the Zora's domain music. If you don't, it's not a Zelda game. Don't care who you are. Da -da 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 -da. Da -da 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 -da. So, welcome to Zora Hall. This is where the band plays and pretty much where all the Zoras are hanging out. Just kind of, you know, chilling. Oh, you know what? I was supposed to do something before this video started. Shit. Shit, 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 shit. Fuck balls, cock, wiener, sh shaft, scrotum taint, ball fetchian. Okay, so this is the back here, and as you'll notice, Lulu is back here. What's up, Lulu? Hey, don't you remember me? I'm your boyfriend. Salt Face is trying to tell you something. You can see it in an expression. Oh, is something wrong? Can she not talk? Well, sad as that is, we've got the eighth checkpoint here, the owl statue. Yeah, buddy. Sweet. We've got some pot. Maybe that's what she's doing back here, getting some pot. And uh, a random island here. Looks very, very fishy. You know what I mean? Oh, hey, there's that giant fish back there, whatever that is. What does this thing say? Great Bay Temple ahead, swimming prohibited due to murky water. Oh, hey. So that must be the Great Bay Temple over there. But we can't swim there. That sucks. What are, the, are those? Hey, those are Deku nuts in the tree. Oh, God, it kills me. Well, um. Did I talk to her as Mikau? Yeah, I did. But I guess she doesn't have anything to say. Like maybe it's because she lost her eggs. It's rendered her speechless. Anyway, there's some super huge pervert stalker fucker up here. Who, if you talk to him, he'll say he wants a picture of Lulu and he'll give you 20 rupees. So, you know, take a picture of her, give it to him, he'll fap to it. It might be this guy right here and then he'll give you 20 rupees. Yeah. See, what a weirdo. Oh my god. No, I'm not going to give you a fucking picture, you psychopath. Anyway, there are torches in here. You could light them with fire arrows, but right now it won't do any good, so there's that. Now down here, Zora Hall. Whoa! Oh, man. Head planted. These are the band members' rooms here. Now, these are important right now, but um, I needed to do that screen off. I needed to do that thing off screen to get them to get the thing I need for this, so I think I'm just going to go do it now. So basically what I need to do, I'll just tell you, is I need to do the deed trading quest, get the moons tier, the land title deed, and then I need to trade that for the um, swamp title deed, and then the mountain title deed. You need to get the mountain title deed and bring it here. So I'm going to go do all that stuff, and I will be right back. Okay, that was boring as balls, but it's done. I have the mountain title, or the, yeah, the mountain title deed, as you can see in my inventory. So let's go do this, shall we, mate? 
Alright, Zora Hall, what a beautiful place. Whose room is this? Somebody's room. Ah, oh, this is... Who the fuck are you? Oh, it's a store. Okay, I can buy a shield if you got it eaten by a like-like. So, ooh, actually, yeah, red potion. Buy this. Buy this right now. I know you can probably get it for cheaper from... What's-her-face? Frickin' this woodfall lady. But whatever, trust me, it's much more convenient that they sell it here. Okay, so all these white dots on the whatever is our doors here. So, who is this? Hey, Mikau, I haven't seen you in a while. Where have you been? Oh, that's right. Evan, your band leader is looking for you. Alright, who's in this room? Is this, uh, okay, this is our what's-its-face guy. This is our drummer. What's up, buddy? Mikau, where you been? Where have you been? I was worried. Concert in town is coming up, but it seems all like all the band members are in a funk. I bet you didn't know that, huh? Especially Lulu. I haven't heard her voice in a long time. She's usually in good spirits, too. Oh, oh, I wonder if this is uh, related to the ocean turning all weird. Actually, I know a little bit of Lulu's secret. Do you want to hear it? Uh, sure. It's a rumor that the ocean is getting weird because there's trouble offshore at Great Bay Temple. And they say that when that happens, something bad will befall the Zora descendant who's been protecting the temple. Do you catch my drift? Oh, so she's been, uh, you think she's the descendant supposedly, supposedly guarding the temple, huh? Well, that's a good guesstimate. And I'll tell you something, he's actually right. Uh, let's head into the room with the octopus. Do I need to see Japas? Yapas? Yeah, we're gonna have a jam session. You know what it is. Jam session, jam session. Hey, what's up, my bass playing brother? Talk to me, Japas. Speak? Is that an option? There we go. Huh. Mikael, where have you been? I'm all like, hey, where's Mikael? The concert's coming up soon. And now our band leader has pulled a vanishing act. Evan's all holed up in his room just writing songs, dude. And to top it off, Lulu just stands out back, staring at the sea. She doesn't even respond when you talk to her. If you guys think it's just because Lulu's not interested in me, I'd understand. But I'm telling you, it looks like something's really wrong. Is there something you're trying to hide from me? I'm not running an inquiry or nothing. But look, if we don't start rehearsing real soon, we're not going to be ready for the concert, man. You know what, Japos? I feel you, bro. You are totally right. Just walk through that Zora real quick. No big deal. Oh, look, that one guy's trying to peek into that room. Oh, it's got a star on the door. Shut up, I'm busy right now. Oh, Macau, you caught me. Uh, I, er, uh, Lulu's been looking weird lately. I was worried. It's not like I was spying on her or anything. I'm not some kind of weirdo or some sort of slimy fish or anything. Um, yeah. Just remember that I have uh, somewhere to be. What time is it? Uh, yeah, I have to be there, like, now. Uh, see ya. <laughs> Fucking all these weirdos here. Okay, so this is Lulu's room. Obviously, she's not in here. She's out back. However, look what we have here. Thanks for stopping by. I'm doing business with folks on Zoras. That makes you a potential customer. Is this your room? I'm awfully sensitive to the sea breeze, so I'm sorry, but I'd like you to rent this room for me. Did something happen in here? Well, I really can't do anything about it. I'll sell you a green potion for 40 rupees. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so um, we've talked to two Dekus in human form, one Deku in Deku form. So, uh, it goes to tell you that we need to talk to this guy probably in Goron form. That's the next form that we haven't talked to these guys in yet. So let's speak. Oh, you're from the mountains. I'm selling green potions, but I'm focusing my marketing efforts on Zoras. Actually, I'd like to do business someplace where it's cooler and the air is clean. But to open a business in another place, you need to go through the proper channels first. I get you. Well, looky what I just happen to have here, feller. Oh, <gasps> that's a mountain title deed. Thank you. I'll give you this land in exchange. All right, and we get the ocean title deed. Okay, don't worry, folks. We only need to do this trading side quest one more time in the game, and then we're done. Whew. All right. So now we can obviously do what we do with every deed thing. We can reach the heart piece that it leads to. That one is right there. That one looks really low, though. It almost looks like you'd be able to get that. There might be another way to get that. Oh, there's a hole in the roof. How convenient. Okay, so we need to be a Deku for this shizzle. Not much we can do with the ocean title deed otherwise. Um, I guess if you haven't done the thing at the stockpot and given the guy paper yet, you could do that. But here's a heart piece, and guess what? That's a new heart container, bitches. Heart container number 12. 
Oh my god, 12 heart containers? Like, are you cereal right now? Is that really real? Okay, let's turn into Macau before these guys freak out that, you know, I'm not Macau or something. It's really weird. I don't think Macau actually even has a room because... Ah, uh, there he goes again. He was spying. This is uh, the band leader's room, so I don't know where Macau's room is. Um... Yeah. Okay, I'll talk to him, sure. Why not? We don't really need to, but I'll do it anyway. Uh, Evan, what's up, buddy? Mikhail, how was it? Did you get the eggs back? Uh, no. Oh, you couldn't do it after all. Have you been to see Lulu out and back by the ocean? Ever since the pirates stole her eggs, she's just been standing out there gazing at the sea and sighing. Mikhail, we need those eggs safe so Lulu can get her voice back. We've grown accustomed to life in a peaceful sea. The only one among the Zora tribe who is still able to go blows with those wild pirates? It is you, with the blood of Zoran heroes flowing within you. I'm still keeping Lulu's problem a secret from the other band members. They've all been looking forward to our Carnival of Time concert. And I can't tell them it's canceled because Lulu can't sing, can I? I mean, I don't know, the guy's got a point, but he's kind of selfish. He's only really thinking about the band, but, you know, rightfully so. But, you know, Macau couldn't pull it off afterwards. He did end up dying trying to get the Zora eggs back or whatever, but, hey, he tried. So, all that's left to do now, we figured out the problem, we need Lulu to get her eggs back so her voice can become back and whatever. So first things first, we gotta get the eggs, and then we gotta see what we can do about Great Bay Temple. So, I suppose that's what we shall do. But where exactly do we start? Well, you know, that's the lifelong question that's been asked for ages. But there's something we want to do before that. Remember that red potion I had us buy right here? Well, we're going to actually put that to use right about now. Whoops. I can't play. There we go. The Song of Soaring. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so now we want to go to... Ballsack. Let's just warp to clock down. Yeah, 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 Don't worry, we're going to actually start getting... We're going to work on collecting these eggs pretty soon here. Hey, it's raining. It's the second day. Um, so now let's just head out. West Clocktown, whatever. It's the closest. Guess I should turn into a Goron. That would be faster, huh? Um, yeah, on this cycle, though, we'll definitely we'll definitely get the eggs and all that stuff, so don't worry about it. Okay, so that's the ocean. Uh, I think I want to go this way. Oh, I don't want to run into a fountain. That was definitely not part of the plan. And die. So we want to head exactly to the opposite side of the ocean. The only other area we haven't been to yet, which is Icona. Stone Tower, whatever you want to call it. Blah, blah, blah. Um, we're not going to get too much of a sneak preview into this area. We're just going to step in for a quick sec. So before you come here, make sure you have uh, a red potion. Otherwise, you are not going to be happy with your results. Do I really need a Pona to... Ow. Man, these guys are vicious. Do I need a Pona to get in here? Let's see if this leads anywhere. Oh, it's a hole. Well, Okay, yeah, let's... Okay, are you all dead? Okay, fine, fine, fine. Alright, let's call a Pona. These bomb dogs keep respawning, these fuckers. This area is pretty crazy, I will admit. I don't really like it just because of how, like, it's fucking crazy. I mean, just look at this. There's so many enemies. They don't hold back, that's for sure. Epona really just right into that? You know, that's fine, because I can't take damage while I'm on Epona. So, ha, lick my nuts, game. All right, so get going full speed right at this gate. Those bomb dogs will try to slow you down. Don't let them. Okay, here's where you want to go. Now, you won't be able to progress in the Icona area past this guy up here unless you have... Unless you have the Garrow Mask, which we do have, but that's okay, because we don't need to go past that area. So there's a circle of rocks here that's very suspicious. So, what do we do with suspicious things? We pull out our Lens of Truth, and oh my god, it's a hidden, invisible soldier. Huh? Don't tell me. That's... I'm shocked. You're the first person who's ever spoken to me. I've been here for many years, waving my arms around and asking for help, but everybody ignores me and passes me by. It's because I'm about and as impressive as a stone, right? I'm used to it, though. 
Um, I have a request. Can you give me some medicine that would make me, even in a noticeable stone like me, feel better? I'm um, sure. You know what, buddy? I got some red potion for you right here. Take this. And I'm still using my lens of truth, even though it's not equipped. Ah, oh, that. Is that it? It's red potion. Man, you drank that fast. You're gonna get the hiccups. And now his head's cut off. I feel better, I think. Thanks. Oh, here. Ingratitude. And he gives us the derpiest mask in the game, the stone mask. It's also the best mask in the game, in my opinion. I freaking love it. Wear it with C to become plain as stone. Now, let me practice standing out. Shiro, the stone soldier was added to your notebook. You helped the inconspicuous soldier. This was added to your notebook. Alright, so now he's standing out. He feels better and he's real, not invisible anymore. So the stone mask, it makes you inconspicuous as stone. You'll wear it and you won't notice any difference. But now you'll be invisible. Look at this. None of the bomb dogs will attack us. They don't even notice we're here. Um... It's pretty cool, really, because now we can become invisible. Now, the reason I decided to get this now is because it becomes useful in this very, very next area, which is a place I'm not going to tell you about because that would be spoilers. But, yeah, it's it makes this next area immensely easier. Like, it makes it ridiculously easy. Like, seriously, you don't even, you don't even understand. Okay, so... Anyways, uh, where you want to do is you want to warp here. Now we need to go find the pirates. We need to go find the pirates' hideout. That's where we need to go. The only area we haven't really explored is uh, kind of over there and stuff. And out into the ocean, so... That is a weird eye on that temple place there. So let's do that. Let's bust on our Zora mask and do some exploring. We need to find this pirate's hideout so we can get the eggs back. So, take a swim around. If you swim out too far, then you will be teleported to some place that is probably not where you want to go. It'll just take you back to the thing, you know, so don't do it. There's some mini games and uh, heart pieces and stuff over in this area, but you can't actually do anything here yet because we're going to need a certain item that we need and we don't have it so balls to that right so we're just looking for any sort of conspicuous aha uh -huh. what is this oh it was a dud wah, 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 wah. look at all these seaweed it's pretty funny pretty cool area so just swim into all these until you find the right door aha uh -huh. this looks like it this looks like a secret entrance okay fine I'll dive there we go and where will this take us? The Pirate's Fortress. Bum bum bum. We are here. Check this place out. This place is pretty crazy. So this is pretty much it. The Jiradu Fortress. And this is where they're keeping the eggs. At least some of them. This place is pretty huge. And we're going to need to infiltrate it. But that's pretty difficult because you can't be seen by any of these guards. Which, as you can see, just even in this area, there's quite a bit. So, that's where the stone mask comes in handy. With the stone mask, nobody can touch you. So there you go. So just use the stone mask until you get into the water. Um, put on your Zora mask. Make sure you dive right away before somebody sees you. Ah, there we go. Okay, now we're down here. We can mess around a bit. Kind of just... I haven't really looked up what I'm supposed to be doing here, and I've... Like I've said, I, I haven't done this very often. Okay, so that's a current shooting outwards. I don't think we're supposed to do anything underwater yet. I think we're just supposed to surface at a certain area. Oh, hey, what's this? Uh, that's a gated area. Can't do much around there. Okay, so we came in over there. Let's try going over here. And make sure when you go over here, there's no... You shithead. There's no Zoras. Oh, hey, this this thing up here leads to a path. I didn't even see that. I mean, I saw this thing, but I didn't think it led to a path. I wasn't really paying attention to that. All right, so get over here, dive, and uh, I see that guard coming over here. In that boot. So wait for that boot to pass. Yeah, and there's another one coming. As you can see, they all four travel kind of close together. 
So just wait until there's a gap, because you can see in between this, after these next two come, there's a huge gap between the first one, so. I mean, or you could just go up there and risk it, but I'd rather not. Look at all those bubbles coming up from Link's skirt. That's like where they're generating, too, is right at Link's skirt. He's got some serious gas. Alright, let's do it. Let's come up here. And just to be safe, let's put on the stone mask. You never knew. If they catch you, they'll pretty much just throw you right out. It's not even an option. You can't even argue with them. Oh, yeah, look at this. It's a fat switch and a target over there. Okay. I can't really do anything about that target, but... Okay, we better hurry before these guys catch up. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. Okay, let's turn into a Zora. <laughs> that Zora mask on the Goron looked ridiculous. Okay, we can't do anything about that target yet, so that kind of sucks. So let's head into that giant place. I can see the moon all the way over here, man. Fishy, I zapped you. I zapped you. Thank you. Remember that thing kids used to do in school? It was called, like, zap, where you write zap on your hand, and then, like, you have to do what somebody says or something. I don't know. It was stupid. I don't even remember. Like, somebody said zap, and you had to repeat what you said or something. I don't know how... I don't remember how it worked. It was pretty dumb. Oh, hey, look at this. We got underwater puzzles. All right. Okay, I don't know. Oh, okay. I'm assuming that's what I had to do for later. You know what, Mr. Macau? You and your neck shit? There we go. Um... Yeah, the controls can be a bit wonky, but hey, such is life. Oh yeah. Okay, and now I dive. And now I pull this one back here. And that allows me to do something weird. Oh, okay, I see. That allows me to push this one all the way through. And make my way through here. Alright. I don't know who constructed these underwater puzzles, but they're very dear to. Hey, what's over here? Okay, that. Um, hey, cool, it's a current. Whoa, buddy. Good thing no guards in here. Oh my god, except there are spikes of death, and I'm pretty sure they're gonna shoot up at me. No, they're not. Okay. So use your ability to you know sink and all that shit to your advantage sink surface all that crap so that you don't fall into areas and whatever well, let's get up here oh it's a door with an anchor how creative not you don't really have to worry about guards in this section you just have to worry about navigating the puzzles and that's really all can I climb up here no don't explode that thing oh hey look it's a chest underwater and guess what we can open these now there's that one in, uh, frickin' Snowhead that we need to open. Um, but you need to turn it to spring. You need to be got for that. And there's some other things we need to do once we beat got too. So I'm just gonna wait till we need to do all those things and do it all at once. Now, these things you won't be able to break with Macau. However, if you turn into Darmani, huzzah, he can break these things with the greatest of ease. Because he's a boss like that. Can we open this door, though? Nope. And there's a heart piece in there. We want that. So let's slouch up the stairs as Link likes to do. And there's a switch behind here. I see it. You can't fool me. Let me in. Let me at him. And it's a fat switch, so you probably need to be the Goron. I think this switch is time, so... Hurry. And huzzah. There we go. And that's another heart piece. Racking them up. Arrows. Gate closes behind you. Hit the switch. Don't worry about it. Okay, and now I'm assuming we just need to continue on in the area. Oh, wait. Nope. There's something up there. Probably a closed gate somewhere or something, so... I like how they're making me use, like, Goron and whatever form in conjunction and stuff. I mean, I wish they really could have made the Deku form been used more. I mean, they do, but the only thing it's really useful for is Deku flowers, so that's really the only way they incorporate you having to use that. 
Which I guess is clever, but I wish the Deku form had more unique abilities. Whoa. Um, I didn't mean to do that. There's a chest over there. It's probably got rupees. I don't need rupees. I've got 4,000 rupees in the bank. You know, money in the bank, so 